Hello everybody i zdravo svima bre! Zdravo svima! Ja bih najradije nastavio na srpskom, ali to je što je. My name is Luka, but you can call me Pablo. You can also find me on Instagram by the name Maps of Pablo. So, show some love. Lajkujte i zapratite. So guys, the wait is finally over. Hurricane just released their song for Eurovision 2021. Like, I am super, super, super excited for this. For those who don't know, Hurricane is a Serbian girl group, which contains three gorgeous, beautiful, talented girls. The members are Sanja Vucic, Ivana Boom Nikolic You gotta say boom, it's not Ivana without boom, okay? And of course Ksenija Knežević They exploded in 2019 with a song Favorito and it's still their biggest hit up to date There are power puff girls from Serbia <laughs> I mean, now they even have the same hair color. Sanja was already representing Serbia at Eurovision. And she killed it. The song was called Goodbye. Ksenia was also at Eurovision, but she was with her father. Because her father is a famous Montenegrin singer. Knez. I'm sorry, Ksenia. I'm not going to talk about your father. It's your time. And Ivana is here for the first time and she's going to explode there at that stage. They are very popular at the moment in Serbia. Each song is a hit. And maybe the most important thing is that even Jelena Karlausha is supporting them. Oh wow, that's rare. And they have an amen from her. That's huge. So in 2020, we had our national final, Belvisia, and they won it. And we were so happy that we're finally going with an upbeat song, with sexy girls, with lights, with choreography. I'm still not over it that we didn't see that live. Here we are now for Loco Loco. I am especially sorry that I didn't get a chance to see that Sanya's move with her eyes. You know, I love that part so much. I feel like Serbia is now in a big hype for Eurovision, more than usual, because we are finally sending somebody that audience really, really likes. It's not a new artist, it's something that we are hearing at a club, like each Saturday. And yes, they have a thing for Spanish. First song is called Favorito, then we had Hasta la Vista, and now we have Loco Loco. Bueno chicas, que bonito! <laughs> A few days ago we got a teaser and the teaser came with a lot of hateful comments for a music video. But let's wait and let's see the full package and then I will comment on it. So I'm expecting a dirty, sexy song with catchy lyrics and sexy choreography. So guys, without further ado, let's get loco. If you want to see my reaction, stay with me. Gori planeta, idemo! Evo ga, loko loko, puštamo prvi put. Ok, this was from the teaser. Ok, we have the Serbian wife. I just cannot focus. This sounds good. I will I will listen to it now and then I will listen to it one more time, okay? Zato hajde budi loko loko. Dobre devojke. Hi 
amazing. I have to play it one more time. One, two, girls, come on. Guys, I am loving this. I need to play it one more time. I feel like I am in Muse Club Novi Sad, literally. my depression, fix my confidence. This song stands for gay rights, prevents COVID-19, and this song can even maybe bring the world peace, I swear to you. something that the whole Eurovision is going to dance to. The girls did not disappoint me. That's my opinion. I like it. Overall, I like it. It's very catchy. It has a very nice repetitive chorus, which is good for Eurovision. Like, it's very easy to remember. Especially those parts. Some, some, some. Na, na, dum, 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 na, 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 na. It's energetic. We need a lot of choreography there. A lot of lights. A lot of everything and yeah I mean I'm very proud of my country congratulations girls congratulations Serbia and everybody who participated in making this song it definitely has strong Eurovision elements and that key change at the end was also nice personally I don't even want to comment that much on the music video I feel like it's a little bit outdated I mean when I saw who's the director everything was you know clear I have a full respect for Dan Milicevic and his work He's acknowledged here in Serbia but guys now we're in 20 21. You gotta upgrade yourself. This is just a constructive critique that I would say as an artist. Yes, he's authentic. This is his vibe. But you can do it also with a better production. I just feel like we're over this. I don't care. I mean, I like the song. This is only what I gotta say. So if we're talking about music video, they're looking like Lidia Vukicevic, Indira and Lepa Brena. Somebody has said that on Twitter and I'm like, yes, definitely. Just cannot wait for the performance. It's going to be loco. Guys, thank you so much for watching. Write me down in the comments. How do you like this song and how do you like this video? This is definitely going top 10. This is totally Eurovision vibe. And thank you so much for watching. Follow my Instagram and subscribe to my channel. We'll see you in the next video. Ciao!